British English versus American English. Let's see how many you get correct. In American English, they say hood. In British English, it's bonnet. In American English, they call it trunk. In British English, it's boot. In American English, they say fender. In British English, it's wing. In American English, they call it gas. In British English, it's petrol. In American English, they say windshield. In British English, it's windscreen. In American English, they call it muffler. In British English, it's silencer. In American English, they say parking lot. In British English, it's car park. In American English, they call it a truck. In British English, it's a lorry. In American English, they say RV. In British English, it's a caravan. In American English, they call it a license plate. In British English, it's a number plate. In American English, they say wrench. In British English, it's a spanner. In American English, they call it a gas pedal. In British English, it's an accelerator. In American English, they say car dealership. In British English, it's car showroom. In American English, they call it the elevator. In British English, it's the lift. In American English, they call it a gas station. In British English, it's a petrol station. In American English, they call it a stroller. In British English, it's a pram or pushchair. In American English, they call it a zipper. In British English, it's a zip. In American English, they say trash. In British English, it's rubbish. In American English, they call it a sidewalk. In British English, it's a pavement. In American English, they call it a crosswalk. In British English, it's a zebra crossing. In American English, they say mailbox. In British English, it's a letterbox. In American English, they say store. In British English, it's shop. In American English, they call it the subway. In British English, it's the underground. In American English, they call it a closet. In British English, it's a wardrobe. Which of these words do you use? Let me know in the comments.